Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to today's Torah Texting Tuesday Challenge. We asked the question. A father rushes back to a grocery store and says, I demand my money back. My son came here half an hour ago, purchased three chocolate bars with stolen money. Stole from me. How could you, Mr. Store Owner, be so negligent and allow this child to purchase three chocolate bars? How can you behave in this way? It is abhorrent. Pay me back the money. Because, of course, my son consumed all three chocolate bars. So forget about the issue that maybe this father needs to have therapy with his son, that whole you know idea there of what's going on here. Besides from all that, is a store owner obligated to pay the father back? Because after all, this child was only 10 years old. So the answer is the following. It depends. If it's a normal thing that children go and they purchase that item then the store owner has no reason to assume that the money was stolen. How, meaning, if it was just a dollar chocolate bar, although I don't think my chocolate bar is for a dollar anymore today, two dollar chocolate bar, right? I think it's fairly normal for a 10 year old kid to show up at a grocery store, to plunk change down on a table, and to purchase a chocolate bar. If that is the case, then the store owner would not be obligated to um, compensate the father because the son stole his money. If, however, a 17 year old were to walk into a car dealership, I were to plug down $50,000 in cash and purchase a car. So I think in that case, a person needs to be a little bit more responsible, require of an investigation, and not just allow a 17-year-old to walk away with a brand new car paid for in cash. But I think if it was just a chocolate bar, which is pretty normative behavior in our society, for a 10-year-old kid to walk in to put, uh, put down cash, then the store owner would not have to compensate the father for, quote-unquote, his loss because his son stole from him three toonies. Hopefully we shan't steal from our parents, nor of course we steal from anybody. That is, the, I think, the correct answer for today's Torah Texting Tuesday Challenge.